Your <laughs> co-star, Natasha Leone, who wow. I, I just a uh, curt handle on the phone. Yeah. Yeah. I know. Well, actually, she left you a little message. She was here, and she wanted to share a fun little fact about you. Take a look at this. Oh, God. Yeah. One thing you might not know about my dear friend, Taylor Schilling, hello, Taylor, is she's kind of a terrible driver in most conditions, but <laughs> for some reason, when we were together in Puerto Rico, she was actually That's terrific at driving. Someone we'll never know why. Thanks, she's so bad at driving in Los Angeles and so <laughs> great at being in charge of all of our driving activities in Puerto Rico. <laughs> Listen, that was fully out of necessity. That was necessity is the mother of invention. I mean, I we were left to the wolves. I know exactly what she's talking about. It was also not a car, it was a golf cart. And that was also at a moment in time where I had been um, fired from a rental car, car rental company in LA. Fired she from did. a rental car company? Yeah, yeah, they were like, we've had enough of your, there were a few shenanigans, like, uh, shenanigans on the road. There were just a few little like, you know, bee bop -a bops you know, just <laughs> <laughs> with people, you know, too many dings. Well, okay. So I heard this story about uh -oh. you. Um, is it true that you had to audition um, and kiss a mannequin? Yes. It was some sort of commercial audition, and I was very young. It was probably like in this some warehouse. I don't know where. How, how I ended young? Up there. I don't. I, where I was, was this warehouse? warehouse? I know. I know. And I know. It wasn't really I know. A commercial. What the hell is going know. on? <laughs> so I was. The, it was something where I walk. It was four. Men and I was the, a, a park bench was set up, and then a, a mannequin, like a dummy, like a store mannequin. Uh huh. And they were like, skip across the bench and leap into the mannequin's arms, let it hold you <laughs> and make up with it and be in love with it. <laughs> and I was like, sure, why not? I didn't, I didn't get the job. So in honor of that, I just thought that. I, I, no, you're gonna. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that kind of deserves a standing ovation. <laughs> like, Hamlet. You, fully, you got the job. You fully get the job. And, you know, in a series of interesting pivots, um, <laughs> I. I was up last night um, watching Dear Edward, your new show, which I have to say also is getting so much tremendous buzz. It's on, it is. I was so excited. It's on every must watch list for the year, the season, you name it. It's, re and, and now watching it and having seen it, I really understand why. It is, um, it's everything. It, it, it pulls at things um, that I wasn't expecting. It, it's such a roller coaster. Thank you so much. Yeah, no, it's, it's true. It's That's so kind. And you're so good in it. I don't want to tell it. You, you, this is your story. You, yeah. you tell it. Well, it's a story. It's, so, it's, we, it's, it's, a, it's based on this book, Dear Edward. Um, so uh, there's a plane crash, there's one lone survivor, he's a 12-year-old boy, and I play a woman who, his aunt, yep. and her whole family dies, she's in this process of trying to get pregnant and have, a, have her own child, and isn't able to, and it's kind of a, a story of healing through community, and how we really need each other. I mean, you guys, I see why this is on every must list. I'm so glad it's getting the critical <laughs> recognition that it deserves. We actually have a clip here. Why don't we take a look at that? I, for one, I'm missing work, not to mention I left Edward home with my husband, which is basically like leaving a 12-year-old boy alone with a man who I love dearly, but is also essentially a 12-year-old. Oh, hold up. Did you say a 12-year-old boy named Edward? Is it the Edward? I'm just putting two and two together here. Are you the aunt? Yeah. Yeah, that's me. I guess I'm the aunt. Oh, oh you're so good in the show. Oh. Every day. Well, will you keep hanging out with yes. me? Will you play a game with me? Yeah, I can't.
can't wait. All right, we're gonna do An just easel. right. I hear you're a, a, a good drawer. I mean, I like I like to draw. I've had moments. That's all we need. Let's do this.